and this field auto report, I looked at the Purina brand dog food product line. There were four retail locations visited, being Pet Bayou, Fresh Co, Sayers, and Shoppers Drug Mart. In this Pet Value location, the Purina brand dog food product line was located in the last aisle in the back corner of the store. Pet Value, of all the retail locations, was the most competitive overall as it is a pet store and carries a large variety of different dog foods. Generally, the shelf placement of Purina's products run from small products on the higher shelves and larger ones on the lower shelves. The biggest competitors to Purina and Pet Value were Pedigree, Imes, and Barkers. Purina offers competitive pricing to combat this competition. Pet Value was the only location visited that offered Purina's premier brand, ProPlan, whose biggest competitors are Neutro and Blue Buffalo. Up to Purina Dog Boots, ProPlan was the only one that had an in-store promotion going on for it. Purina's dog food line had a good amount of shelf facings with its close competitors combined, only having just about double the facings than they did. In Freshco, the Purina brand dog food is located in the second to last aisle, near the freezer section. Unlike Pet Value, Freshco carries the One and Alpo line of dog food from Purina. Freshco does not have as much competition for Purina compared to the other locations as Purina has a large section of shelves for its products. Purina also holds more than half of all the dog food facings at Freshco. It appears Purina has a good advantage over its competitors as it holds most of the facings and has lower prices without having to use in-store promotions for their products. At Sayers, the Purina brand dog food is located close to the registers in the center of the store. Purina also faces a lot of competition in Zayers, as Zayers has two large shelf sections specifically for their private label brand, President's Choice. On top of this, they also carry other brands like Imes, Pedigree, Neutro, and Natural Recipe, which are in direct competition with Purina. Due to the competition in Zayers, Purina offers in-store promotions as well as advertises their products in Zayers' weekly flyer. Purina's facings could use some adjusting as placements on high shelves behind clip strips and scattered facings make it hard to locate the product on the shelves. Although the total facings is a bit higher for Purina and Zayers compared to Freshco, Purina still makes up about 20% of all the dog food facings in Zayers. At Shoppers Drug Mart, the Purina brand dog food, along with the other dog foods, are located in the third to last aisle near the freezer section. Again, Purina faces competition from Imes and President's Choice, but still keeps competitive pricing. On the opposite side of the aisle is the chips and drinks section, which is a high traffic area of the store. It is a shame that Purina and the other dog foods are on the bottom shelves as this is an optimal location for Purina's products to be seen. Shoppers has a very small selection of dog food with Purina making up 6 of the total 18 facings. Of these facings, Purina does offer a couple in-store promotions, but none of these are advertised in Shoppers Weekly Flyer or on their website. Looking at the packaging, you can see that the color stands out to grab your attention. The writing is easy to read and you can clearly see the Purina branding, along with some of the benefits the food provides to your dog. It also has a little girl holding her dog, which helps to support Purina's targeting of families as consumers. On the back of the packaging, it provides more information, like how to reach Purina on their social media and their phone number, and where to learn more. Purina's website is excellent as visitors can learn about the company and its products as well as being able to see on the front page all the local locations you can buy their products at. They also have a very active social media presence too on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and you can check out their YouTube channel where they show off some of their products and they interact with their customers. Much of Purina's advertising is done through commercials on TV and YouTube but also through flyers of the businesses that sell their products and also through ads on social media and apps like this example that you are seeing right now. 
some improvements that Purina could be making is by advertising more in-store flyers, offering in-store promotions where they are lacking, and trying to improve product placement and facings in store locations. Overall, Purina adopts a cost leadership differentiation strategy as they keep the cost of their products very low and often undercut their competition, as well as offering a selection of dog foods for different dogs and different owner needs.